previously on the Retro Game Couch. It was all smooth sailing for chaos, while Rampage's programming dreams ended in one big frustration. Welcome back to the Retro Game Couch for part 2 of this epic epic. <laughs> So the challenge is over and it's time to reveal our dreams to each other. I'm very curious what uh, you managed to make in, uh, in a month. I can finally show my game. Yeah. Yeah, I've been uh, uh, wanting, uh, wanting to show uh, the game to you for noticed, a long time. Yeah. What are we going to do? Let's load up your game first. Fine. And then but I'll play your game, then I'll load my game and you play my game. Yeah. Okay. Cool. But we'll need two controllers for my game. Oh. Hold on. And there's always a joystick around here. Hold on. Yeah, holding right one. Got one. Awesome. So two controllers. That's yeah. That's ambitious. Yeah. <laughs> I was I was ambitious. Thank you, sir. So it's a two player game, I guess. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so it's called Pong. Yes. Awesome. Yeah. Let's play play uh a match of Pong. <laughs> it's only five. Uh, yeah, it's very efficient coding. Should I review the code first or just let's just let's play first? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's actually doing something. Look. There we go. Hey, your controls are not working. <laughs> what? What's going on, dude? What is this interface? Your controls are broken. <laughs> well, you fucked up my review. Thanks. <laughs> you had some problems. <laughs> uh, some, yeah. <laughs> it shouldn't come as a real surprise. I actually called you. <laughs> yes, you did on several <laughs> occasions. Yeah. Okay, so well, you're doing some peeking and poking, so that's cool. Yeah, everything was going quite well actually until well, everything <laughs> I changed from from here on. Uh, Managed to f up my coat. Oh, that's that's a Beyond shame. Recognition. Did you enjoy it at, at all? The oh, challenge. Absolutely, yeah. What do you What did you think of basic? That was my question. Well, uh, the way I went into it was wrong. I went into the month, of course, thinking I have to make this and that and this and that, and you just have to start at well the beginning slowly. And I just was, was too ambitious, too quick. And yeah. Okay. Just... Yeah. Because really, for somebody that never wrote a single line of code in his life and you managed to eventually come up with this is pretty epic well i, I guess i don't uh, my first programs weren't uh this cool no okay <laughs> cool yeah so, yeah okay i i i figured i'd make it look like pong <laughs> well okay yeah. let's uh do a reset yeah and load up my game. Finally, I can show my game. I think it's this one. Man cave. Oh no, <laughs> mine cave. Yeah. So, um, is this the? Yes, this is the correct one. Yes. Is mm. that a lot? I I have no clue actually. It's it's programmed pretty efficiently. Cool. Yeah, it's not a big game. At all. Before you load it up, how did you enjoy this month of basic coding? Well, for me, it was it was a trip down memory lane. <laughs> yes, I can imagine. And uh, yeah, it really brought back a lot of memories, and uh, I enjoyed it a lot. Very cool. Yeah, I can't wait. Actually, I'm gonna load it up. Here it is. Mine cave, a game by Elmer Winners. That's you. Yep. You have a mining claim on some land. You're looking for the red diamond. You start with level one tool and need to. Yeah, so basically there is um, there is a red diamond uh, on the bottom of the screen. Yeah. And well, let's just load up the game. Uh, you have health, you have oxygen, and you have ladders. That's all you need to know. Oh, cool. And I think yeah, this this one I guess. I like to chill. I like a challenge. I like dying. <laughs> so let's uh, go with uh, like a challenge. This is the screen building up. That's the shop right there. Uh, these are the different layers of. Um, uh, the, the the ground. Oh, very cool. So you start in dirt and then rock and then and there's the red diamond. So that's you. 
and you can move around. Oh, cool. And if you press down, it goes, it mines. Oh, yeah. And when you press up, it ca cannot go up. But if you press fire button and then press up, then it places, places, a ladder. A, places a ladder. Oh, yeah. And I have 98 ladders. Yeah. So if you go down again and then uh, down again, then you will see that your oxygen will slowly start decreasing. <laughs> so, and, uh, well, you cannot hear it now because we uh, don't have it connected. Oh, we do. I can create some sound. <laughs> I utilized it, the SID chip. Oh, very cool. For the first time in my life. Was it hard? No, this is... That's this what she is, said. This, <laughs> <laughs> this is just one uh, one line of code. Yeah. But, oh, awesome. This is quite an um, yeah, it, extensive it, it, game. You can go to the shop now, if you want. Yeah. Very cool game, dude. Yep. Nice. Mine cave. Obviously Minecraft inspired. Yep, very much. <laughs> yeah. Nice. It was actually my son who uh, came up with the name. So. Oh, uh, cool. Yeah. Props. Kudos to him. <laughs> yep. So, Very uh, cool, dude. I think it's time to see what uh, what our judge thought of uh, our games. Yeah. Let's uh, check it out. Yep. Hello and welcome to another episode of Commodore Repair Service Russia. Today, very different episode. I will be sent two games from the Hollands by a ray, ray, red, red gay coach, something like that. And I have to review those games on my trusty Commodore 64. Uh, so I hope you enjoy. I am very eager to get the packages. Bring them on. Well, first package has arrived. Look at this. It's very well packaged. Nice. Very good. Let's see what is in the inside. Uh, ah, there is the one game. Let me see. Oh, looks very good. I will put on desk. Well, let's see what is in this package. It's very nice packaging. Uh, comes with a manual, it's very big manual, look, it's Commodore Minecraft 64, Commodore 64 version, with a nice box art of the miner, I guess, uh, let's open up, ah, there is the game on cartridge, very, very nice on cartridge, with great art, and very thick manual, very good, nice, nicely done. Let's try this game out now. Let's put in this very nice cartridge and see what happens. On the right top you see the shop and the little man you can move to the left and then if you go down it go hex down and another down etc. I will now fast forward a little again to show you how far I get. Well, this is near to the end of the game where I uh, got a lot of money, 800, almost ready for the next level, finding some newer diamonds. You can uh, find three swords, and uh, you see I have only one hard life left, because yeah, I fell down a couple of times, and I missed some oxygen updates, and now you can see on the top left that I have one oxygen left, and we're running back home, but I can't make it, and I died. This happens a lot in the game, it's a very tough game. And I never got to see the red diamond. Well, today other package arrived as well. A different package in. Uh, let's see what we put there. It's very well, very well packaged, but wait a minute. It's cloth. It's uh, is the other game. Well, let's find the discs in one and try game.
Засветали яблоки голуши, поплыли туманы над рекой. Выходила на Катюша на высокий ветер крутой. Would strain on drive, but the wheel fix later, almost done. Well, I'm not sure what's happening, but not a lot. Um, maybe it's missing uh, something, maybe last disc, let me see. Um, there is disc with the final disc, I have not loaded, pong tips. Maybe there is something in there that shows me what to... Wait a minute. Wait a minute. This is absolutely good. Oh, let me redo. So I got this very well packaged program from Clemens and uh, I will now load it loads very quickly and it runs like uh, runs like hell. Look at these beautiful stripes now behind this beautiful image which we'll come back to later is some serious code uh, some languages for next but also look if we rotate image like mirror then a text reveals itself it's the russian anthem russia translates like russia is our sacred state beloved land powerful strength great glory properties for all time etc well the best about this game is that you can just sit and watch and drink vodka and, and just enjoy the beauty of it not zrovi Ivan stretchy bros net tet tel to kablyat no woman leave me alone i am getting high school on the pong game Well, let's make final conclusion of these two games. This is very well packaged, has some clever code, but it's very complex game, very, very tough. And this, however, is uh, has everything you want in game. Uh, it's uh, simple and still entertaining. And as a famous uh, Russian philosopher once said, Paul Kotsky, a simplicity is the most complex thing and so for me clear winner is the pong by Clemens Almost no clear winner definitely clear winner what the hell did we watch <laughs> did I win <laughs> why did we send it to a Russian <laughs> just a disclaimer I didn't send him money I didn't yes you did <laughs> no you didn't <laughs> That was so weird. <laughs> okay, uh, so, well, this was not a scientific. <laughs> uh, okay. We need a new judge. Yeah, let's draw Ohio. Thanks, uh, Russian Repair Service, uh, for uh, reviewing the game. Whoa, that was what? fast. <laughs> so, Ohio, thanks for coming along. Uh, let's play some Pong. All right, let's F3, do it. F3, right? F3. Yeah. Runs the game, yes. Okay, this is my pawn and it doesn't work. Basically. Awesome. Seen enough? Yeah. Thanks. This is my game. And this Your game is working. This is a working oh. game, I hope. Oh, I didn't press load. Hold on. Woo! Mm -hmm. You're kind of dying, yeah. <laughs> so you haven't... You've been able to find zero ores so far, so that's... Uh, yeah, that's, that's amazing. That's amazing. Uh, it's, oh, I found yeah, one. Yeah, you found one. And two. Two. Ah. So, hi -o. <laughs> Yeah. Who has won? Hmm. That's a tough choice. <laughs> well, of course, Clemens didn't have a game that was actually working. So. <laughs> a small detail. <laughs> Let's brush over that. Yeah. yeah. Gaius has won this round. Woo! I won Fair a versus enough. challenge. Yeah. Yay. Congratulations, sir. Yeah. Very nice. So, hi, thanks for judging. Jeez. Oh, sorry. <laughs> 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 Jesus.
<laughs> also, thanks to uh, Commodore Repair Service Russia for your impeccable judging. Thank you for your uh, vodka induced uh, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> judging. Uh, very nice, very nice. And uh, yeah. Yeah, and uh, you, uh, everyone, uh, thank you so much for watching, and uh, we hope to see you next time on, on the Retro, Retro Game Couch. Couch. <laughs> <laughs>